Monday. Welcome to a new week. I hope you're having an amazing day so far. I think I'm having a pretty good day. Cam's taking a nap. It's Ty's birthday today, so I am not pre-filming. I'm gonna get this video together so that I can enjoy the rest of the day once Ty comes out of school. I wanna enjoy the rest of the day with my baby, but she turns 10 today. We've been celebrating all weekend and today will be the final festivities. So it's a good day We're gonna go ahead and play around with a few of my ipsy glam bag items for the month of November If you haven't seen my unboxings all of my ipsy unboxings the paid and the PR are live and This happens to be one of two try-ons. I owe you guys I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna ask what is on the face. So I'll show you the eyeshadow palette I actually just filmed the eye look for Instagram, it is the Alter Ego Mirage, I almost dropped something, Mirage palette. I got it in PR, she is stunning, she is beautiful, and I finally got around to playing around with her. This look was so easy, stunning. If you have Instagram, make sure you follow me over there because I'm like filming reels and stuff. The blush is a Ofra palette. It is the professional blush palette. The blush that I have on is this one over here. I have a Bobbi Brown lip balm on and the brows, actually it's Ipsy. Well, the face is also Ipsy because I use my Laura Geller powder and then for the brows, I went in with this. I got it for like $5 over on Ipsy Shop. I got the darkest shade they had. It has little shimmers in it or at least it looks like it has shimmer particles in it and like real, well, I, ooh, I think the camera's picking it up. So for me, I was like, is this gonna make my brows look shimmery? And I thought it was a powder, but it's not. It's like a pomade cream thing. It's waxy. I was able to apply it with an angled brush and my brows are looking good already. Like I haven't even finished them off because you know, I have a product from the Ipsy Glam Bag that blah, 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 blah. we've started. From the Ipsy Glam Bag that I wanted to try. So far the brows are looking good and we are going to get to answering preguntas, not preguntas, responding to you guys' comments here in the video. So I just wanted to show you guys what the face is because you guys typically want to know. I'm going to skip on this. I've tried this. I'm going to use this as my travel, the Grown Alchemist. It's more like a cream, but it's an exfoliator. It's minty. I've already given you my review because I've tried this already. So, but I'm going to go in with my Benefit 24 Hour Brow Setter and I'm going to read a comment. So this one is from Lori Daniel. It says, I have missed a couple of your videos or a few because I was away with my grandkids and my son and daughter-in-laws. For a week, I didn't watch YouTube. I played with the grandbabies. Thank you. I'm going to check them out. Listen, do what you need to do. Spend time with your family. I think that's the beauty of YouTube, that you're able to always go back. I don't delete my videos. I keep them up. I mean, I have some really old videos and the quality was crap. And if we're honest, some of it is slightly embarrassing. Like one time I was orange for a while. Like I went through phases when it comes to YouTube. My quality and the audio and there would be an echo at one point. You could hear a radio station in the background because the mic and it was a whole thing. Listen, my videos will stay up. That's what I'm trying to say. I always sidetrack because it's like a squirrel. <laughs> squirrel. My videos will always be up and I think it's always amazing when we prioritize our family. You only get that time, but f like for a certain amount of time and you don't know when's gonna be the next time. So I would rather you guys, if you have to have dinner with your kids, do that, prioritize that. Date night with your husband, your significant other, go ahead, do that. Spend time with your grandbabies, go on vacation, do that. When you come back though, make sure you watch the video so you don't miss out on stuff. I applied her, she's gonna look like this. You have a very fine, area and then one that's a little more on the curved side and a little fluffier and there's like the visual and it's basically a clear gel literally you're just gonna comb it up this is how i do it i'm gonna comb it up i let it semi dry and then i will apply another layer i like that the edges though like the sides are flat so technically if you have really thick brows that has enough product you can kind of like glide it through like a spatula just like nice and flat and then use the bristles to comb it into your brows the brows look shiny that's because they're still wet the uh, brow setter hasn't actually set yet. Is it going to last exactly 24 hours? I have really stubborn brows, so I'm gonna tell you no. For me, they don't. They only last a really long time if I've done my brow lamination and it's maybe like two weeks in and I go ahead and I apply this, my brows will pay attention and listen. I don't know why my brows do what they do, but they do. See, now that it's kind of like semi-dry, I'm gonna go in and apply a little more. I'm gonna leave it alone. And then at this point, we're good. I am 
probably two weeks overdue for a brow lamination. So I might end up doing that tomorrow. Not the point. There we go, sidetracking again. The point is, does it last 24 hours? I've never kept it on 24 hours. When I have brow lamination, it lasts a really long time. Next, we have Morigana. And she says, Cam is like her mama Sita. Thank you. Uh, she says, beautiful and absolute delight. Got a flu shot, so after my nerve blockers and my entire right leg is numb. Oh, that sucks. That sounds painful um, and uncomfortable. That eye pencil by Laura Mercier. It is beautiful. I love Bobbi Brown baked gelatoin peach. Have I tried that? I am loving Boxy by Ipsy. They improved so much. You can request bubble wrap instead of a useless paper with holes. <laughs> the last order I got was bubble wrapped and Miha, nothing broke. Yeah, I feel like when they go ahead and bubble wrap things, that usually works a lot better than that little like filler paper. I'm gonna go ahead and use the highlighter if you guys recall. I ended up getting a V Cosmetic highlighter. I don't know if this is full size or deluxe. I don't get mad at highlighter sizes like this anymore. I used to be like, mm, I want full size. I don't get mad anymore only because this is gonna last you a long time. I don't recall when I have hit pan on a highlighter. I'm looking this way because again, Cam's taking a nap. I think she's going through a growth spurt. So, you know, I have to keep an eye. She doesn't like roll off or something. But anyway, this is in the shade Autumn. And then they also sent over a Formula Z brooch. So this is what I'm gonna do because I remember swatching it and it was stunning. I'm gonna tap out and then I'll pop some of that up here so it'll capture the light in a beautiful way. So if you've been here for a really long time, you've seen Morgana, I'm not sure that that's her name, maybe that's just her like channel or like account name, but she has been a follower and a commenter and a supporter for the longest time, a longest time. She has basically shared her healthcare struggles with her family here on this channel. And it's insane to me because she could be feeling like straight up poo poo and she would still make the time to come on here, comment, chat, and be our friend. And she's uplifting and she's amazing with everyone and people like send her positive vibes, hugs and kisses and all that good stuff. And she's there for everyone else as well. So for me, she's one of those people that we all need in our lives. And I appreciate you taking the time to comment after your flu shot and you know your side effects and everything that you're going through on a daily basis. And I, I love how kind of like makeup and beauty brings us together because she could be feeling like straight poo poo and she'll be in the hospital and she's watching these videos and she's real quick to chime in on product and skincare and makeup and my favorite this and my fat. And that's what I'm talking about. Makeup can be therapy. Makeup could be amazing in so many different ways and if anything, it could be a distraction sometimes and not sometimes we all need a, a distraction here and there because life is not easy like not at all see how pretty that looks that looks so nice i'm not mad at this the eyes are really pretty anyway but i feel like this and you know like the little halo topper and then now the brow bone area maybe i should have skipped the brow bone hold on let's fix that i'm gonna use my beauty sponge and that is my eraser that's a little tip and trick for you guys if you have a beauty sponge and you applied highlighter and your brow bone or something like that and you're like you know what i kind of hate it i don't want it there anymore use your beauty sponge that you use for concealer to kind of like drag it off and it just kind of like it's like tape it removes it and then we have connie who says thank you for the pencil emojis connie you guys are freaking troopers by the way with these emojis you guys are so much freaking fun you guys are amazing okay so connie says i am just getting over rsv it was five long weeks i feel for poor cam and her mama take care curl take you. If you guys can hear it, oh, by the way, I, I sound so much better right now. Cam has RSV, which means that she got it from the girls, and that's why the girls were still sick three weeks later, because although they were feeling better and the fever was gone, they no longer had the dysentery or whatever it was that they were going through, they still had that dry cough or like that phlegm that wouldn't go anywhere. Sorry, it sounds gross, I know, but they had that. And so when I took Cam to the doctor, they were like, nope, um, RSV lingers for at least four weeks. So they told us like, get the girls who are feeling better but still have that cough situation, get them on the nebulizer machine, get them going. Mind you, this is a doctor recommendation. I'm not telling anybody to do this. I'm just telling you what I was told to do. You know, so I ended up getting Ty and Jasmine 
on the machine twice a day. Cam is basically 100%. She just has that uh, raspy voice at this point, and slowly but surely, it's getting better. Pero nena, I ended up getting sick, and my sister ended up getting sick. We woke up, and today I woke up feeling amazing, but we woke up, I'm gonna say five, six days straight. This is all last week. I don't wanna sidetrack too much, so I'm gonna grab a lip lana. I got a cute little haul. Um, and I filmed it. I put it over on Instagram. It's a Gerard Cosmetics thing. All their lippies were 60% off on the website. The lip liners were like $4.80 or something like that. And then the lipsticks were $8. Freaking deal, steal. You didn't need to use a code or anything like that. You could just snag the deal. And of course, they sent me a few items, which one is a backup because sugar and spice is almost over. But then I got a few new ones. I got the Red Immortal. We'll try that in a different video. But I have to try the Estate Lippy and I need to use one of these. I think I'm gonna go with Nude. Anyway, I go to sleep and when I wake up, I felt like I had swallowed a toad, right? But not only did I swallow a toad, that toad just so happened to be like cousins of a ninja turtle, cause it was like a ninja toad stabbing me from the inside of my throat. Like I couldn't even swallow. So I was so blessed to have pre-filmed a lot of videos. Every time I swallowed, I felt like there was like a ninja in my throat just stabbing me. It was horrible. The uh, uh, the fla the flavor, no, flavor. Um, fra I was gonna say fragrance. The shade name is going to be Priority. I thought it was very pretty. I feel like this is the very first one I get, but I'm not 100% certain because y'all know I forget everything. And I chose the perfect lip liner. Okay, so that lip liner is Nude by Gerard Cosmetics. This lip combo is actually very pretty. Funny enough though, it throws a little on the peach side if you ask me. Like on camera, it looks pinky peach. In person, it looks pinky peach. That doesn't look pinky peach. It looks very mauve -y. I'm not mad at it though. Okay, so I've given you feedback on the products featured in my glam bag so far as we've gone along. So you already know how I feel about everything, but it is your turn. Make sure you let me know if you've tried any of these products. And girl, given that we're playing this emoji game and it's kind of fun, put a, a sick emoji next to your comment because your girl, I still feel a little something something, but today's day one that I wake up feeling better. And it is time we thank our channel members. You guys are absolutely amazing. Every day I wake up and I have more members and more members and it's just fantabulous. You guys are the best. Now when it comes to channel memberships, it gives you access to exclusive content. I just launched and completed an exclusive giveaway where two people won a bundle, but that was just for our members. I've also been posting members only community posts where my members get to chime on in on makeup and product and the members will be choosing the products I will be applying on my face on the next Shop My Stash. And there's gonna be so much more going on in memberships, so if you're interested in joining memberships, all you have to do is click the join button down below, right below this video. If you don't find it on your device, on your phone, on your computer, no worries, check the description box below. There is a link that will allow you to join this channel's memberships. All right, you guys, I really hope you've enjoyed today's video. Happy birthday to my little Tai Tai. And as always, I will recommend two playlists here on screen. I feel like you're really gonna enjoy. So I hope you guys consider checking it out and I'll see you guys really, really soon.